Decision time. Now our objective is to kill him. And you get bonus money for killing him, but well, you'll see. I surrender. What? Easy now, Agent. UNATCO has a policy against killing unarmed prisoners. We have much to learn from each other. We're assuming control of the airfield. The vaccine will be returned to the international authorities. Don't you want to hear why your brother came over to our side? He makes his own decisions. You know he wouldn't betray UNATCO without a reason. Good work. Now finish the job. He surrendered. He's an unarmed prisoner. UNATCO policy protects him. Terminate the prisoner, Agent. If you are too afraid, you are ordered to return to base on Manderley's authority. There is a helicopter waiting. Mm. Well, I want to talk to him first. If you know something, just tell me. The question you've got to ask, I'm surprised you haven't, is the obvious one. Who am I? Who made me, and for what purpose? UNATCO has briefed me on my augmentations. Get to the point. Return to base, Agent Denton. I will handle this. Your parents were murdered precisely because they could have told you the correct answer to that question. That's a pretty big claim. You didn't have parents. The ones you knew were employees. You were made by a couple of technophiles so crazed for power that they would control not only governments and people, but the chemistry of our bodies as well. Leave us, Agent. Now. No. Sounds like a picture-perfect description of the NSF. Think bigger, Agent. Think global. You have disobeyed a direct order. Do you think it's an accident that the cure for the global plague is owned by a single corporation, and that it's kept so secret that only the tabloids dare print a story suggesting it exists? The supply is limited. That doesn't mean there's a conspiracy. But where does that corporation manufacture the cure? And where did your brother uncover the information that brought him over to our side? Go on. I can tell by the expression on your friend's face that she knows where I'm heading. Yonatko is completely correct to think that Tracer Tong will soon understand Ambrosia. He was the one who was going to receive the shipment. Why tell me all this? I've said nothing that Yonatko won't find on this plane's computer. But here's the secret. This is what Paul was so interested to hear from Tracer Tom. Manderley will be disappointed in your insubordination. Whatever. Oh, oh. Ah! oh she killed him. He's gonna tell me something important. That is what happens to a prisoner who tries to escape. Go to the helicopter now, Agent Denton. It is waiting at the airfield. Something fishy going on here. Get to the helicopter. Manderley will want to see you. 9905. She just executed an unarmed man. Maybe Unatco is not the kind of place I thought it was. Maybe there is something going on here. After all, why couldn't they create enough cure? See to the helipad. We know your brother was here. He is gone, but we will find him. All clear, sir. Okay, now we can start looting the place. Because turrets and cameras have been shut down for us. Yeah, we're full on those. I think that's a satellite dish of some kind. Kind of weird looking though, huh? Hmm. 
that, fellas? We've disabled the security grid. Good to know. Where's that ladder at? You gotta play hopscotch. There it is. You got to uh, run and jump to the next one to get all this stuff up here. <laughs> yeah, full on lockpicks, too. You get the idea. Probably nothing important anyway. Probably. Probably. <laughs> sniper rifle. Although why there's no sniper up here, I don't know. That'd be a perfect place, wouldn't it? They could have seen me coming and stopped. Sabo rounds, all right. Shotgun ammo, which will penetrate the uh, heavy armor. Oh yeah, I forgot about the changing ammo, because well, we haven't had any ammo to change. I don't even think I have anything for this one. Yep, never mind. I'll show you switching ammo when we Get some ammo to switch. But the assault rifle could shoot grenades, shotgun, sabo rounds, <gasps> or buckshot. And I own oh, tranquilizer. Oh, yeah, I have shown you guys that. See, there's tranquilizer darts. Oh, I'm using the wrong, wrong key, so. Regular dart. And I have no flare darts, so. Herman. What's up, my man? Talk to me. Mandoli has assigned me the peacekeeping occupation of the airport. Standard procedure, it appears. I'm sure we can count on you. I want to be the one to execute Lebedev. Some bad news. Agent Navara beat you to it. Yes, of course. I will congratulate her. Hey. About my brother. A shame that we have to track down and kill one of our most advanced agents. At least we have one of you left. <laughs> Don't you think we should give Paul a chance to explain himself? He's been with you, Natko, for years. Only one thing can happen when you break your oath to the coalition. Jerk. Get gun. There's got to be some reason Paul would uh, just up and leave like that, right? Let's see, I'll save here. Why not? <sighs> okay. This is our ride. The recoil weapon mod. Get 
a lot of those. Which is good, because we have a lot of weapons with high recoil. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. Is worth it. Put it on that one. And we'll drop the shotgun because I want an assault shotgun. Oh, clip. How much do you hold now? Nine shots, okay. Lunter told me about Paul. It's true. Paul's been working for the NSF. This is gonna shake up the coalition, JC. I don't know if you've realized how important your brother was. The coalition will recover. I'm not so worried about the coalition. UN officials will probably get involved. You'll have to keep your head down if you're gonna come through this in one piece. Sure you're ready to head back to base? I'm ready. ready. Let's Why move not? out. Get in. at HQ. And we will go ahead and end our set here. And I hope you've been enjoying it so far and thank you for watching. Till next time. Bye.